A shootout in the middle of a busy parking lot as armed men went after an armored car. And Fox 26's Gabby Hart joins us live at that Chase Bank on North Freeway where this all played out. So Gabby, what have you learned? Uh, well, Caitlin, you can still see the Brinks truck uh, parked here behind me. Uh, that is what this investigation centered around. Also, crime scene tape still blocking off this parking lot. Shell casings that spanned all the way from this Chase Bank and into this busy Walmart parking lot. Today, we're speaking with residents who frequent this area, and they're giving their thoughts on this brazen crime that played out in broad daylight. In the world today, that doesn't really surprise me. I mean, it, people are doing crazy stuff. Houston residents reacting after two suspects wearing face masks and armed with guns committed a bold robbery targeting two armored truck security guards. It's crazy. I think they're drinking some water that, that, that nobody else has been drinking. It's something in the water. Around 11 o'clock Friday morning, a Brinks truck arrived to the Chase Bank on North Freeway. One of the guards got out, opened the ATM, and that's when a suspect walked up and shot him in the arm. They didn't, you know, just holding that gunpoint or anything like that, they just immediately shot him. Police say while the suspect who shot the guard stole money from the ATM, a second suspect held the driver of the Brinks truck at gunpoint. But what these suspects didn't count on was an off-duty University of Houston police officer who was working security at the bank. She was sitting in her car as the robbery unfolded and she jumped into action. She discharged her firearm at the suspects. Very smart. I mean, on top of her feet, uh, aware of, of what was going on around her. After she opened fire on the suspects, described as two black men in their early 20s or 30s, they started shooting back. Then they took off in a black suburban, still firing from the vehicle in the middle of a busy shopping center. The suspects fled with three cartridges uh, belonging to the ATM, and it's unknown the amount of money that they may or may not have gotten from those three cartridges. I mean, I'm 70 years old, and I've never seen the world as bad as it is now. God is gonna have to come through here and straighten them out. Yeah, now, uh, police did tell us earlier that one of the suspects they believe was hit by gunfire. However, right now, those suspects still on the loose. The FBI is here investigating the bank robbery portion of this crime, while the Harris County Sheriff's Department is investigating the shooting. Of course, as soon as we learn more, we'll keep you up to date right here and on our website, fox26houston.com. Also, uh, the security guard who was shot is expected to make a full recovery. For now, I'm reporting live in North Houston, Gabby Hart, Fox 26 News.